Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 20, and this is war number 7, and we're going up against an alliance called Renegades. So, as usual, I've already scouted out my path, and I'm going in with my standard team. I don't see anything uh, on the path that would make me deviate. So, I'm not the first one in this time. Uh, so I go off to the left, I take path 2. If you've been watching my videos, you already know. Uh, but this first fight here is against Medusa. So I'm like, hmm. They have the defense tactic, stubborn, which I hate. Um, I'm having to deal with, you know, the power struggle, the uh, strike counter, and all of that. So I said, you know what? I've got a bunch of these. Let's use them. We're getting close to the end of the season. And so... Now's the time to use these uh, boosts. Otherwise, I don't use them anywhere. Uh, so I'm just looking over and I'm like, what, what do I want to use? You know, I'm like, yeah, we'll use that. This time I did that before he got hurt so that you get the most out of your boost. If you aren't familiar with that, you don't want to use that health boost when you are down in health. You want to heal up to full, then use the boost. All right, so we're going in here with Medusa. Now, I remember when Medusa was the go-to boss, um, but not anymore. She's too easy. All right, you'll notice how I'm fighting with Nick Fury. I did a parry, a medium, and then a heavy. That got that uh, deep wound or open wound uh, up really quickly. You know, it was just two, two combos. Parry, medium, heavy, parry, medium, heavy, and it's up, okay? And look at her, she's almost dead now. And the real Nick Fury has not come out. She's still fighting the decoy. All right, so I'm just waiting, and there we go. I had to smack her a little bit because she didn't want to fire that special two. And you will get wrecked. If you get hit with any part of that special two, oh my goodness. I can't tell you how many times I've evaded most of it and then got hit on my little toe on the end of it and get wrecked, you get stunned, and then she just goes in, usually with three Furies and wrecks you. So next up, we've got Phoenix. Now the only thing with Phoenix is that right of the Phoenix or, or whatever uh, that gives her a little cheap death. All right, so you can see I'm doing the same thing here. Um, medium, heavy, and I've got that wound on her. And now we're just gonna try to do as much damage as possible, but I'm watching, all right? Because here, I back off, and there we go, right of the Phoenix, and then boom, down. If you go in hard, and she gets that right of the Phoenix while you are attacking her, she goes crazy aggro and just starts wrecking you. So this time I went, hit a little tap, let that thing go, and then went in and got her. Very easy champion to fight if you know what you're doing with her. So now I'm like, well, hey, here's a mini, and uh, it's open now. Huh. I'm feeling myself. Nick Fury, he's been putting in that work, and I'm boosted. Let's do it, right? So this guy, the only thing about him is you have to watch out for that when he has an evade charge. All right, see, like right there. Now, we got lucky, and he whiffed, all right? Um, but now that he doesn't have the evade charge, you're fine. He's a lot like Miles Morales. Except he gets this evade charge after he fires off a special. But once you get that evade charge down, he evades once. You're good after that. Okay, this time I decided to fire a special one. Um, I believe the special one should stop his evade. But since he didn't have an evade charge, really it was just a waste of a special one. Um, but... I was just thinking, you know, if he fires off a special again and I fire the special one off and get that uh, disorient or whatever on him, um, we should be good without having to bait out that evade. So down goes that uh, mini boss and the real Nick Fury has still not come out. I love Nick Fury in case you couldn't tell. All right. So we ran out of energy there. Uh, we came back when we had our energy. And now we are continuing the war journey. So you can see I'm the last one in. And 
I'm going to fight this Hulkbuster. Now, I still need to learn how to fight the new Hulkbuster. You know, um, he's a little different than the way he was before when it comes to fighting him, especially. Um, and, I, and I'm being facetious. He's a lot different. Um, but for the most part, uh, you don't have to worry about too many different things when you're fighting him. Uh, I do know that I get that shock on me. And I'm still not sure how I get it. How do I avoid it? Not sure. Leave a comment if you know. Because um, I haven't even looked into it. Like, see, I have a shock uh, debuff on me right now. All right. So you see, I'm just doing the same thing I was doing before. Got that uh, open wound, deep wound. His specials are unblockable. So you have got to evade them now. Um, and I've gotten wrecked because I've blocked. And if you get hit with that unblockable while you are blocking, you're going to get stunned and you're going to get wrecked. So it's a little bit different. You have to pay attention. Okay, and you see, I'm just ripping him up, ripping him up. Look at that. Boom. Down he goes. And guess what? The real Nick Fury has still not come out. I love me some Nick Fury. Let me tell you. All right. So they didn't place a defender on that next one, which is why they were able to clear that mini boss without me having to uh, uh, enter that section. All right. So now. I'm looking over this and I'm checking out these different nodes and I'm like, hmm, I see that domino over there. Yeah. And it's stunning reflection. I hate stunning reflection and I hate domino. I ain't taking domino. No way. Psych. Y'all should know better. I do not run from the fights. I run to them and I don't like domino, hate domino which means I'm going after Domino, all right? Now, Warlock is the best option for Domino that I have currently, all right? Now, I can take Domino on this node, more than likely, just with a different play style, with Nick Fury, um, especially because when the real Nick Fury comes out, you don't have to worry about the stun, okay? So he is stun immune when the real Nick Fury comes out. But with Omega Red, that's who I would have to, if I was playing with Omega Red, I would have to do a, a change in my play style, try to fight, you know, fire off those heavies, interrupt her heavies with my heavies, that sort of thing. Um, with the Nick Fury, doesn't really take much of a play style change uh, since he's going to be stun immune once the real Nick Fury comes out. So... You see, I'm boosting up because I'm taking the fight seriously. I don't like Domino. I'm not even trying to play with her. Okay. And uh, I'm all boosted up here. Got my tech boosts on. Got the health boost. I haven't used him. Uh, so the, the health boost is great. And then just in case, fire off that invulnerability. I hope they're back in the store soon because uh, I'm starting to use up uh, mine. All right. So here we go. And what I have to try and uh, be conscious of here is not trying to parry, which is what I do almost everywhere else. Okay, so I'm trying to do this like a stun immune fight. All right, and uh, here we go. Fire that off. It didn't drain nothing, but she isn't infected. All right, now she's infected, but she fires that off. Got a crit failure. Don't care. All right, she's infected now. Um, but that crit failure, man, whew, annoying. All right, so here we go. She fires that off. I just decide to block it. Not trying to play with any kind of evading, nothing with her. And then I got a special two ready for her. Hello, how you doing? Boom. And that is the end of Domino. All right, so great option against Domino is Warlock. And uh, so I'm like, whew. I'm feeling myself. I'm all boosted up. You know, Warlock got, you know, quite a bit of his health. I'm looking over here. Brute force. Hmm. That's not a bad, uh, bad node there. I said, but you know what? Let me calm down. I'm a soldier. Somebody may have a better option. Let me not hog all the fights. All right. So we didn't take down this thing. Uh, so we'll be back and you'll find out how we did in this war.
And we're back. And as you can see, we won this war. So that's two wars in a row after two losses in a row. So we're making a comeback. Uh, so that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all have a blessed day.